At first glance, these seem like photographs, but look closely and you'll notice they were actually made with a paintbrush. As, as realistic as I can possibly make it, um, I'm, I'm taking my level of detail to an even further extreme with this one. Hyper-realistic artist Robin Ely creates the photo-quality oil paintings using human models. I feel like there's something more than, than a photo. There's layering in you know, it. The photo's quite flat. Born in London and raised in Adelaide, Robin and his wife Rachel moved to Los Angeles last year. To be in a city that I, th I think struggles with, with um, ideas of personal identity and, and connection, I think is very relevant to the work that I do. His first solo exhibition in Hollywood sold out. It's travelling to South Korea later this year. Uh, Robin has made some serious headway in the international art scene because of who he is and his willingness to take risks and stand up to scrutiny and criticism and also embrace the accolades modestly. Never hung a painting that I didn't think was 100% there. But perfection takes time. The Archibald Prize finalist paints for up to 10 hours a day, seven days a week. Two to two and a half months to get to where I am and I'd say probably another two to finish. This self-portrait will feature at a gallery in the Hamptons, a playground of the rich and famous. Many Australians come here to Hollywood to launch their acting career. But with a booming art scene, Los Angeles is now attracting some of our best visual artists, hoping to make their mark on the world stage. Now it's very convincing. You have superpower galleries, international galleries who have locations all over the world also calling Los Angeles. But despite his brush with international fame, Robin says Adelaide will always be home. It's a great city and I, and I, and I love it and I, and I do miss it. In Hollywood, Melissa Wildey, 7 News.